You must be kidding. What? Kurt Gibson? What am I supposed to do with Kurt Gibson? He's got no knees. <laughs> well, what am I supposed to do with Reggie Jackson? What's this, Old Timer's Day? Hmm. <laughs> hey, how neat. <laughs> Elephant gone? <laughs> See, guys are kind of exchanging cards here and everything. Here's one worth $250. Take a look. See who that is. <laughs> Ted Williams? Who's Ted Williams? <laughs> Give me the card, man. <laughs> You've got to be putting me on. Ted Williams? Probably one of the greatest hitters of all times. That's all I can tell you. I just can't believe that you guys don't know who Ted Williams is. He hit so many balls out of Fenway Park, man. They thought it was snowing all year round. <laughs> hey, hey, Dwight, Dwight, you're not gonna believe this, man. These dudes with these funky little cards. <laughs> don't know who Ted Williams is. <laughs> you don't know who Ted Williams is? The Splendid Splinter, huh? Is that what they called him? Yeah, that was his nickname. Who called him that? It was never on any of my cards. <laughs> you gotta read the fine print. Everybody called him the splendid splinter. Wait a minute, let me read the fine print. <laughs> Ben, don't pull this stuff on me. I'm tired of it, okay? Okay, but you're gonna miss the first sign of spring. Wait a minute. The first sign of spring could be... Yes. Miss Kelly in red leotards. Where is she? Right there. It's a robin. Cut it out. Cut it out. A robin, you. <laughs> I think what we should do is get you a midnight paper route. How about that? About 216 houses, up one side, down the other, and no bicycle. <laughs> See you around, Ben. <laughs> Drop that spoon. Rob, today is the first day of baseball tryouts, and you're having Mr. Toasties? No, uh, you're going to have yourself a power breakfast. Power breakfast? Uh-huh. Okay, great. <sighs> Voila. Cold spaghetti. Yeah. Protein, bulk and carbs. Listen, Dwight, why don't you just let the boy have his cereal? Because I want him to be ready. He's gonna make that team. Good morning. Boy, I slept like a log. <laughs> Look who's here. It's the original Splendid Splinter. How you doing here? Waldo? No, not Waldo. My name is Van Gogh, and look, I cut my ear off, and some of my skull, too. Oh, your lips are moving. Yeah, so are yours. Are you done with this, Grandpa? Yeah. I know you played first base, Dad, but I'm gonna go out for the outfield. Hmm? I don't want to have to make conversation with strange base runners from other schools. Oh, but Rob, that's half the fun. You know, you get a runner on first base, and you give him a wink and say, hey... <laughs> I had a great time with your sister last night. <laughs> what if he doesn't have a sister? Never mind, Rob. <laughs> Listen, 
You know, I remember. It seems like only yesterday. I know that's a corny cliche, but you were playing first base in high school. Big as you are right now, as a matter of fact. Six feet four, that huge glove. Boy, you picked him up, you mm -hmm. threw him. What an arm. But you see, the one reason I think you know now uh, you didn't make the majors uh, was pitching. Yeah, yeah, couldn't hit a curveball. Well, happens to a lot of guys. Most of them play for the Mariners. Don't make fun of the Mariners. <laughs> Never make fun of a major leaguer. They make a lot of money. That's not what you say when you watch them on TV. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's uh, that's real good there, Robbie. But uh, you know, I think you need a little something to chew. Here, you wad that up, put that in your cheek, huh? And you gotta get the, the attitude, you know? <laughs> Walk over here, <clears throat> pick up the bat, the lumber, the big stick, knock a little mud off your cleats, step into the box, stare that pitcher down. Okay, Meat, fire it in here. Show me your best stuff, Meat. Come on. And it's a long fly ball! It could go all the way! Oh, and it's a home run! Today, day, day, I consider myself so, so, the luckiest man on the face of the earth. I think Miss Kelly scared the robin away doing those exercises. What exercises? Gotcha! Yes! You're gonna have to do some time. You had long, smooth strokes. <laughs> Ever see Karate Kid? Wax on, wax off. <laughs> wax on. Oh, that's, uh, <clears throat> that's great, Elaine. It's your idea, Dwight. <laughs> Did uh, Mrs. Yamagami tell you that there's 187 windows in this school? Huh? <laughs> All right, let's get to it. Hey, Mary, I'm gonna need a few more consent forms for baseball tryouts. Some kid catches a pop-up with his molars, and uh, I gotta cover my gluteus. Yeah. <laughs> you know, Vince, uh, you should have seen Robbie this morning. Yeah, he had his uh, glove all oiled. He had his power breakfast. Uh, getting and... ready. <laughs> you know, um, I think uh, attitude is really so important, you know? I, I think I'd rather have a kid with a great attitude than a kid that could hit the ball low 400 feet. Yeah, well, that's certainly an opinion. <laughs> You're letting Robbie play? You're not worried? Why should I be worried? Remember second grade when Robbie was playing dodgeball? Those were a lot of stitches, Dwight. Oh, come on, that was second grade. I mean, it just seemed like a lot of stitches because his face was smaller. <laughs> I wish they'd hurry up. I mean, I'm going to the park to shag some flies. Don't tell me you're going out for baseball, too. Yeah, Robbie and I talked about it. He thought it'd be good for me socially. I hope they have some stretch uniforms. <laughs> so we're standing there waiting to bat, and Willie Schrader says, uh-oh, coach is pitching sliders. The slider's sort of a sharper breaking ball that drops. So I tell him, drop your elbow so you can punch it to right. Guess what? What? Second pitch, bam, over the right field fence. That's wonderful. You hit a home run. No, I struck out. <laughs> Willie did it just like I told him. And as he was round in second, he gives me this big thumbs up. You should have seen it. Oh, I wish I had. I like baseball. Your dad used to play, too, from what he tells me. Yeah. How many times have you heard the two-out, two-on home run against SMU story? Many. <laughs> the educational portion of the day is officially over. I'll get my glove. Hawaii Five-0. I used to love that show. That guy's wearing a toupee. 
and the five O is how much you paid for it. <laughs> what are you staring at? What are you staring at? A dummy. Me too. <laughs> I'm gonna go get some sandpaper. Van Gogh. Hey, baby, what's shaking? <laughs> I better get him out of here. Oh, darn. You mean they left you in here all alone? It looks that way. Oh, talk about a base just waiting to be stolen. Is that all you boys think about? Baseball? No, no, that was more a sexual comment. Really? <laughs> How come I didn't get it? Well, I guess you got to know a little bit about baseball. Oh, but I do. Yeah. Yeah. I like baseball. Really? Actually, I like anything physical. Oh, yeah? Why didn't I know that? <laughs> it's true. Uh -huh. Get that heart pounding, the feel of your chest heaving and straining for oxygen, <laughs> the thrill of victory. You're talking about a night game, aren't you? <laughs> I'm telling you, I'm sorry. I hate to admit it, but you know, Robbie is just one big stiff. Yeah. Mm. Dad, I'm gonna give the kid a little credit. At least he's out there trying. Come on. Oh. At best, he's a bench warmer. Well, that's really encouraging, Dad. Why don't you just go out there and tell him that, huh? Just squash his hopes like a like a bug on a pavement. I'll tell you, a bug on a pavement could do better than that kid. <laughs> Good workout, guys. You see that last shot sail over the fence? And Robbie Davis will touch all four! <sighs> Robbie, you just ran around the bases. Dad hit the ball. Yeah, well, what about the one I did hit? If it weren't for the ground, that would have been a line drive. <laughs> yeah, and if it hadn't have been for Dad's glove, it would have made it through the infield. You know, that guy's flammable. <laughs> Man. Waiting for fly balls really does it to your neck. Yeah, especially when you catch them with your forehead. <laughs> How are you feeling? You better get some ice on that, Rigo. You know, Rob, I think we uh, better have a little batting practice tomorrow. You were stepping into the bucket. Yeah, but we got the whole weekend to work on it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> whole weekend. Whole weekend. <laughs> He's got a great sense of humor. <laughs> what an imagination. <laughs> All right, I admit he's no Jose Canseco, okay? And he's no Jose Feliciano. <laughs> How about Jose Ferrer? How about Jose Menes? How about San Jose? <laughs> Carlos Jose. Jose, Jose, Jose. <laughs> okay, Robbie, let's see you jump on one now. Does he know he's supposed to swing? No, 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 no. You gotta lean into it just a little more there, Rob. Yeah, a little further, a little further. Oh, you, get you, closer to the plate. Yeah, you're pulling out. Just lean into it. Yeah, yeah, don't step on the ball. Oh. This bat's top heavy. Yeah. I'm gonna yeah. go with the metal. You can get some pop off this. Yeah. 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 Bat. Yeah, it's a bat, it's a bat. We never use those. Oh, oh, almost, almost. Just, yeah, that's just almost. keep your eye on it and just yeah. step right into it. Right there. No, come on, Rob. Lean into it more. Yeah, let your dad hit something. Come here. It's uh, embarrassing. A lot of people in the park are looking at you. <laughs> there you go. Hey, See? Hey, 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 hey. 27. I missed 27 straight. Well, consistency is important. Here we go. Oh, hey, that wasn't bad. That wasn't bad. That was a little better. Hey, I just You're open up the hips. There you go. Yeah. Oh, I'm yeah. not. Guys. I could never hit like a that. A lot of anger. This is a game. Oh, my God. Please. What's happening out there? Oh, my Lord. You think you can do better? I think so. Come on, get in here. Okay. We can do better here. Put some more money in the machine. Well, I tell you, I was a Pendleton, you know. Yeah. They played the naval base, beat them 35 to 2, and that was in four innings. <laughs> okay. Is your bad? You know who you, who you look like? Anybody ever tell you you look like Babe Ruth? 
Bless your heart. <laughs> all right, here. Yeah. All right, all right, let's see. Okay, For let's the little see boy some. up there, there's little Jimmy. Jimmy Fresiascus. Uh, <laughs> bring him over there. Bring him over there to the window. That's it, bring him close. <laughs> Another kid to the window. <laughs> all right, here we go. There you go. There you go, all right. You're pretty good, man. You got a swing there. This is just like practice. Everyone's hitting it but me. Well, you, you're gonna get the hang of it. Please. Please. <laughs> Then, of course, there's the Jane Fonda slow workout tape. I could lend you that one. Oh, I, I don't think that I could keep up with Jane Fonda. Oh, yes, you can. This one, she just lays on the floor and remembers the 60s. Yes. <laughs> you know, you remind me a little of Jane. Hmm? Yes. Mm, I mean, you know, the way you walk, the way the fluorescents catch your hair in the lunch line. <laughs> Vance, <laughs> you're embarrassing me. Continue. There's two on, two out, and SMU has got this big righty up there, you know, trying to beat me with a heater, bottom of the ninth, okay? I step into the plate, he throws it right down the pipe. Boom! Downtown. <laughs> you ever try to play in the big leagues? Oh, that's enough talk, guys. Let's get to practice. Come on, guys. Let's hustle out there. Yeah. Go, go. How you doing, Vince? Well, we're about to find out. Today, we cut the wheat from the chaff. Mm, how rural. <laughs> uh, Dwight, I want you to know, Robbie's got uh, some hustle. Yeah? You know, I think he's got some raw talent there that a, a real coach like you could develop. Huh? Come on, guys. Hustle out now. Yeah. Pick him up, pick him up. Let's go, go, go. They got some good prospects here. Yeah, hey, fun. Coach Montecito. Hey, Robbie, you're looking good. All ready to work? Let's go. <laughs> See ya. You were talking to the coach, weren't you? You were telling him not to cut me. No, I wasn't. I wouldn't tell him who to cut. Why not? He works for you. <laughs> Use your clout. <coughs> I don't have to start. I just want to make the team. Maybe you will. You know, Rob, you've had a, a really great attitude all during tryouts. Well, it's because I liked being on the team, but that's over. No, it's not. It's not over till it's over. You're quoting Sylvester Stallone? Yeah. <laughs> Rob, you know, being cut's also part of the game. Who said anything about being cut? No one. No one. Just get out there. Give it your best. Go! I probably shouldn't tell you this, but Vince Montecito told me that Robbie has hands like stone. <laughs> you know, Dwight, a watched boy never arrives. Man, oh man, oh man, I wonder what happened, huh? Hard to say. I made it. You made it? Yeah. You made the team? Uh-huh. You made the baseball team. <laughs> oh, Rob, that's great. Oh, man, way to hang in there. <laughs> my man, my man. <laughs> How'd you do, Rigo? I'm no ball player. I'm a lover. <laughs> hey, hey, what's this on the back here? He changed his name? Equipment mugger? <laughs> You're the equipment manager? Yeah. When I found out I got cut, I asked Coach if I could have the job, and he gave it to me. Hmm. So, uh, you're not gonna be bothered by the sun in the outfield, huh? No, I'll be in the dugout where the action is. Uh. <sighs> Plus, I still get to take batting practice, and I get a uniform. <laughs> I see it. Looks great. I hope you're not disappointed. Oh, no, no, I'm not. I'm not disappointed. Are you? No, nah, I'm happening. I made the team. That's all I wanted. Come on, Regal, let's celebrate. There's pie to be had. I think that's, that's great. I'm glad that he's equipment manager. Well, at least he's on the team. That's great. 
I don't think you mean a thing of what you said. You're devastated, man. You are devastated by the fact that he lost out. He'll never see the majors. He'll never even get close. He won't even make the billboard with those <laughs> funny little underpants that they wear. That's not how I feel. That's not how I feel. That's how you felt when I didn't make it. And you know something? I knew you felt that way. You know why? Because it broke my heart, Dad. Because I feel like I let you down. You know, we were out there every day on that diamond. You would give me batting practice, hit me ground balls, pop flies. I didn't want to make the majors just for me. I wanted to make it for us, together. You and me, you know? So if you're trying to hurt me, Dad, you don't have to. Because I've had to live with that pain every spring. Dwight, I... I'm sorry. I, I never... I, I ne ah, I got you! <laughs> <laughs> Sit down. Sit down. I don't want to talk to you, okay? What's on your mind? Uh, I don't know. So many things. Let me ask you something. What's it like being a dad? Huh? Oh, gosh. It's a... It's a lot of work, you know. A lot of stuff I, I don't think we have time to get into. You know what I think I, I better do is just get you to bed. Oh, no. Not really. Yeah. It's early. It's early. Come, come on. on. Come, come on, on. Van Gogh. Let's go. Come on. 